Yo yo, since the latest release of the Surf app, we have now introduced smartwatch support. This means that we support any smartwatch which is available on the market that can receive notifications from a phone onto the smartwatch. In this video, I will give you some more information about how to set up your phone and what the requirements are of a smartwatch. Let's dive into it. We get quite a few questions about what smartwatch works the best with the Surf Wrap. So let me give you three requirements for your next purchase. The first requirement, make sure your smartwatch is waterproof. A pretty obvious one, but make sure it's waterproof. The second one, you need to be able to connect your smartwatch to your smartphone. And the third one is you need to allow the smartphone to send notifications to your smartwatch because the surf app is using notifications being sent from your phone to your smartwatch with all the jump details as you will see soon coming up in the video. Now we know the requirements of the smartwatch, let's have a look into setting up your smartwatch with the surf app. Since the surf app is using notifications, we support any brand smartwatch there is on the market. Um, we've tested it with Garmin, Sunto, Polar, Apple Watch, and this is all working fine. As long as you make the connection between your phone and the smartwatch and you allow notifications being received on your smartwatch. There are hundreds and hundreds of smartwatch brands, so we haven't tested them all. But I'm sure there's loads more than the brands I just told you that work in combination with the surf wrap. So if you know another brand that's working with the surf wrap, please write them down in the comments below so we can tell other people that those brands are working as well. So how do I start recording a session in combination with the smartwatch? Let's have a look into it. It's pretty easy. What you do is you go to the record screen and you go to wetsuit mode. You press play and you lock the screen. That's it, now you can go start kiting. And yes, you still need the phone, by the way. Uh, we have looked thoroughly into smartwatch standalone so that you can go kiting with just a smartwatch. But unfortunately, this is not possible at the moment. But we are still looking into this further. And maybe in the future, when the smartwatches get more powerful, we can also support standalone smartwatches. But as I said, it's not possible just yet. Now you have started recording a session in wetsuit mode. Every jump you make, you will receive a notification on your smartwatch. Let me show you how that works. So to test if your smartwatch is working with your phone, you can make a fake jump. Let me show you how that works so you can try it at home as well. So first of all, you go down a little bit and shake the phone. Then you go up, you imitate the jump here. You land again and you shake the phone again a little bit. Meter. There you have the notification straight on your wrist with the jump details. To finish this video, I have two more tips for you. The first one, turn up the brightness of your smartwatch screen as much as possible. It's just going to make it a lot easier to read the notifications on your screen, especially when it's a sunny day. The second tip, have a look at your strap. Make sure it's a very tight strap, that you can't lose it when you might make a crash during your kite session. That's it guys, that's all the information you need to know about riding with a smartwatch in combination with the surf wrap. If you have any questions, please write them down in the comments below, or well, you know how to find us, use Instagram, Facebook, or email. Well, see you on the water, see you on the leaderboards, and see you on the air. Ciao!